I bet you can guess where I did the last painting, what size it was. Okay, what I'm going to do, I'm going to use this swirly gig, where I called something with myself. Uh, basically, I just pour loads of paints in, the paints mix up, and create some nice patterns, hopefully. Uh, I'm leaving this paint on, this paint where I've uh, done previously. So it'll, it'll just help everything flow. So, I'll just try and centre it. Stick a bit of white in there. And just start going with a few different colours. Use all the paints up. Just use them as I need to. Give me a little bit of black in there to give it a bit of contrast. I haven't put any silicone in these paints. I'm slightly tempted to put some in. In fact, I think I will do. Might be a little too much there. No, the cells are coming up beautifully, actually. Drop a silicone in again. Make sure it all blinks as well. You can actually choose where you want the colours on this. I think we need a bit more white on this side. green on this side and definitely a bit of red on there You get some really nice effects with this. And you also get the tree ring sort of shapes with this one. Much of the colours left now. Just the duck egg colour, which added a bit of, um, I think it was burnt sienna to it, to give it a bit of a darker colour, more like a grey colour. a couple of trips left now. I think I'll just put a spot of black in on this side. Yeah, 
There we go, touch all that. As you can see from there, but it's got some really nice patterns in, some nice swirls. There's actually plenty of paint in here, although it's not covering. It is very thick though, which I will need to get rid of if I can see if it ends up going too thick that is where you get your cracks you don't really want any cracks on you I can afford to get rid of a few soles here Definitely some interesting shapes there. Just wipe my hands off. Drop everything on the floor. And just roll. The swirler, I will be sort of cleaning it out as best I can do with a bit of a pep tool then disposed of it. I'm now going to go straight ahead and um, go for the cells. paint is going to continue moving because it is very thick at the moment so what I'll do, I'll put on a time lapse and you'll be able to see how it, it does drain off the record is straight, I, I measured it with the level but as always the paint needs somewhere to go even if it's straight so we'll have a look and see where it goes
一起。